Hey you, welcome back to the channel. Brandon DeMarty Hewitt here. Gonna do your Libra Scorpio cusp reading. That's right, the Libra Scorpios, welcome to the channel. You don't necessarily have to be a cusp, you could be a Libra sun, Scorpio sun, wherever these placements are, it fits for you. Stay here for a minute, check out this message, okay? So, Divine Squad, that's my little subscribers. Thank you for your likes, your shares, your subscribes, and your comments, okay? So, noobs that you bring into the channel, hit that like button and subscribe. Become part of this divine family, you know what I'm saying? And let's get into your cards and see what is in your energy now, okay? I'm going to lay two cards out. Those two cards are your duality in the present moment. I'll lay more cards out, tell you a story. That story will have your message. After your message, have your outcome and your verdict. And then you're free to go. All right, we'll take that. First card out, Magician. Just spit right out, okay? So we're gonna take that. So it looks like you're trying to manifest something, right? Manifest something. Hmm, pull a rabbit out of your hat. All right, here's the next card. Ooh, achieving some stability here, okay? You have that Nine of Pentacles, so you're achieving stability in this moment. You're single, you're abundant beautiful right so nines are about achievements so you're trying to manifest that ten of pentacles okay nice <laughs> okay so that's your energy now we'll get to the first card of your story we'll see what's going on i have another deck here for clarifier just in case but i don't really need it sometimes so there you go queen of cups interesting Hmm. Are you trying to manifest a relationship because you are single with a Queen of Cups? Or are you focused on your journey manifesting and you are using your intuition about something? Hmm. I don't know. Let's take it a little further. Let's see what it is going to be. Queen of Wands, sassy pants, two queens here on the board, right back to back. Hmm. Intelligent, beautiful, creative, stable. Both of these are stable. Looks like it's a reflection of you being balanced, okay? You got your passions, which is the wands, it's your fire, your drive, your mojo. The cups is your emotions, right? So it looks like you're balancing those two together pretty well. They're both pretty stable. Okay, and this is going to help you probably attain that ten of pentacles here, which that's what I really feel like you're trying to do. You're trying to get to that ultimate stability, right? A nice car, nice job, you know, nice house, all that kind of stuff. And it takes a balanced person to kind of get that way. So you need to balance your, you know, your inner drive. You also need to balance your emotions and your logic. Okay, let's keep going. Page of Cups. I don't feel it's an offer. I think it's something, some kind of news. You, you're getting some kind of news. News for victory and success. Okay, so whatever is going to come in, because you are balanced... Like I said, in your emotions and in your passions, your motivation. And your motivation is to manifest um, more abundance. It's pretty much it in a nutshell. Crack that open. You know what I'm saying? So there you go. You got that six of wands. That's four movement. That's victory. That's success. Right? This also could be someone giving you... Uh, something that brings much success so it could be in addition to this nine of pentacles to bring you the tent we're about to find out there it is there it is that's that one more pentacle you needed so it is a gift someone is giving you which i really don't know it could be in a, it could be in the way of a raise it could be a bonus right but this is this is successful so you are you you'll have victory in getting this because it is being offered to you 
because it, the, eight, the page of pentacles is right next to the nine of pentacles so if you're trying to manifest more abundance well here it comes and it's successfully yours mm, that's good because you got yourself balanced over here And this is not being illuminated to you. So this comes out of nowhere. This comes out of the dark. Like I said, I think it's a raise or, or a bonus or, you know, something of that that builds your stability a little bit more. Okay, and you're worried. You're like, how the hell did this happen? I don't know where this even came from. Um, yeah, nine of swords, a little anxiety, stressed over it. But it's not that bad. Only because it's... You know, with the moon card, it's not illuminated to you. It's been in the dark. And so this offer is being given to you out of nowhere. And this puts you in that stress of disbelief, I would say. Yeah. Page of Wands. It's because somebody spoke about you. So maybe when you're at work and you put in, in this effort, you know, um, Maybe you have a coworker that's like, hey, this person does a great job and they do this and they do that and boom. They tell the boss and the boss comes over and says, well, hey, you know, you're pretty balanced. You got your stuff together. You're a really hard worker. You're doing some good things. And they're going to bring in this victory, which is unbeknownst to you that they're going to give you this one additional um, pentacle. So now you get to the ten of pentacles because nine plus one is ten. Okay. <laughs> nice. Looks like someone's going to raise or a bonus, right? All right, we'll take that. King of Wands, right? So this person who spoke good on you is a King of Wands energy. So this person is um, pretty up there. In, in, you know, it could be your supervisor, it could be your manager, something like that, right? Somebody that came in and, and really brought this news forth for victory to give you this one more pinnacle of abundance so. and that changes your stability my friends like I said 9 plus 1 is 10 there's your 10, 10 of pinnacles that you're trying to manifest more abundance so someone's definitely getting a raise here like I'm telling you okay so the high priestess says you kind of knew this <laughs> You knew this was coming in, right? High Priestess, Page of Pentacles. You knew this offer was coming in, but you didn't know when, basically when. So that's why that moon card's right there. It's all in this little triangle, okay? Nice, not too bad, not too shabby. So let's get to the last card. Oh. These cards are crazy, man. They're so, so bendy. Okay, right, right, right. All right, enough play time. You knew this was coming in. You just sensed it, okay? That's the High Priestess card. You knew it, right? Eight of Cups. Yeah. So Eight of Cups, it says you're walking away from things that don't emotionally serve you, okay? You're in search of that Ten of Cups, right? But more like so here with the Queen of Cups and then the Queen of Wands, this is your balance. You're balancing your motivations. You're balancing your, um, your emotions. And so... Sometimes work is frustrating. Sometimes people, you know, piss you off. And so you're like, oh my God. And you never really cracked under that kind of pressure, under that kind of um, conflict. And so that's what you're walking away from was all that kind of conflict. You left that all behind because you knew that you were beyond it. You were better than that. So you didn't have to really, you know, get into it. Okay, so that's the story, my friends. Let's get to the outcome. It's going to be the outcome. Yep. Somebody collaborated with this. Like I said, somebody uh, of a higher authority came in and spoke good on your name and said this person's a hard worker. They deserve this. This is that collaboration. So maybe now you get a little team. Okay, Maybe now you get promoted to that uh, supervised position where now you're going to be, um, you know, teaming up with other people, collaborating. You know, let's, let's see what that last card is. Okay, because now this is going to be interesting because these people are very um, uh, 
in and out, right? So maybe at work you have people that, you know, miss deadlines. They're not quite on their jobs and they slack on some things. And now here you're being offered a position to um, kind of command that, which means take control of some of the in and out wishy-washy things that these people are um, going through, okay? Let's keep going. I'll get a couple more. That's judgment. Yeah, so you are being put in the spot to kind of fix things, kind of make sure that, you know, all the T's are crossed and all the I's are dotted. People are, you know, keeping up with their deadlines, things like that, okay? Because you are being put in a position to um, handle those kind of things, okay? And this is that abundance because with a new position, you get a new raise, right? You maybe got a bonus. It's all because somebody of your authority over you spoke good on you and you couldn't believe that this all kind of happened but you, you you had a feeling because you know your own worth obviously here with the queen of queen of swords and i mean the queen of cups and the queen of wands so this is what you're manifesting i hope you enjoyed that because that has been your reading i'm gonna leave it here with the judgment okay so congratulations you guys definitely deserve it i hope it all works out for you well and um Hit that like button and subscribe if you have not become part of the Divine Family. Um, check out my other playlists. I got more tarot. I got some funny stuff. I got some serious stuff. So binge that if you wish. Anyways, peace and prayer, my friends. Have a terrific Tuesday. Mm -hmm.